Hello everybody, here we are again for the second series of the quarantine sessions, a part of the Anastasia method. I am Natasha Papadopoulou, alumna of Sonberg Institute of Master of Voice. And today we're gonna be moving into some more juicy details and we're gonna be using this beautiful two lemons. Last week, we concentrated on the areas of our needs, this area here, and our wants, this area here. And we also activated forcefully our talent point, which is this area here. We also learned our inspiration point, which is very deep in here. And we used a lot of the breadth of talent, which we will be using today again but today the class is more concentrated on massaging and learning a lot about the area of our shoulds which is these two areas here so our shoulds have these little blades in the back which maybe you can see or you can definitely feel for yourself and these are the area of i should have known better this is a little diagram. So the area is divided in three sub areas. It's the area of I should have known, should have been, should have done. Okay? So we will do our best to massage and exercise them. Why? Because this area of our shoulds and should have beens and must do's, it is an area of weight and heaviness and it carries a lot of responsibility that's the main issue so the first thing we have to do today is to go and find our responsibility point which is a point that is here so you follow this really long line muscular line that is it's not on the bone, it's on the muscle. And you go ahead, take your middle index link and try to find that area that kind of feels sore. Okay. Do it with your links for a little bit. And then go ahead and take the lemons and try to Use the pointy side of the lemon, not the one that has the stem, rather this little pointy side. And let's go ahead and try to find that area of responsibility by doing a little bit of massage on it. So go around, it's probably a couple of spots that hurt. And in between those spots, try to find the epicenter of this hurtful area this is your responsibility point. I know it's not so easy to find, but it's the times that responsibility is, is a readjustment. So we really need to internally try to find the responsibility point, try to realize what our responsibilities are. So, somewhere here. So go ahead, take the lemons and try to push a little bit on your responsibility point. Here I want to invite you to close your vision input, concentrate on your imagination point, which is here and always helps, and just take a couple of long breaths from your needs and exhale from your wants. For the ones that are just joining, we're doing a little self massage on our responsibility point, point that really hurts over here, with the help of the lemons. So let's go ahead, close your eyes, take a big breath in, and exhale from your wands, and push and rub the lemons in kind of circular movements, and inhale, and exhale, and inhale, and exhale, try to enjoy a little bit of pain, try to feel like you kind of have 
a sense of where your own responsibility is, this is a very good start to try to separate our own sense of responsibility with a sense of should have been, must have been, must do. Okay, so let's do this for a couple of long breaths. Turn so the people that are just joining can see where we're massaging this lung muscle, our responsibility point. One long inhale and exhale. And now let's go ahead and lay on the mat. Try we keep the lemons in the responsibility point, okay? So we Keep the lemons here and we slowly lay down. Here we don't let all our weight on the lemons. We try to keep uh, we try to keep just that little bit of of pressure, but not a lot. So then we take our luck, which is this area here, and our links. We interlace our links and our luck behind our thoughts, which is this area here, and then we rest on the lemons, not all our weight, but some, so we feel the sense of responsibility, and here we will close our eyes, again, focus on our imagination point, and we will take very small breaths for with inhales to the left and exhales to the right, we inhale from our wants and we exhale from our needs. Do it at your own time. Just keep the breaths long. Let's start. Try to feel a little bit of pressure and if you are comfortable with a move, maybe you can make it a little bigger, but don't make it too big. This is supposed to be a tiny little movement of initiation of your responsibility point. And exhale, and inhale, and exhale. Move a little bit on the lemons from side to side. And if you want to readjust the lemons, you feel like they move, feel free to do so. Just try to stay on that area of should have done, which is the upper cervical area of problems. And inhale to the left, exhale to the right. Close your sensory input, focus on your imagination point. Try to lean on the lemons as much as you feel responsible for and just go with your own breath flow for the last 10 seconds. Small movements are enough for this point. And when you're ready, let's take a last inhale and exhale and a last inhale in the middle and hold the inhale here and squeeze your inspiration point. Your respiration point is deep in here. Squeeze your inspiration point, hold the breath, feel the breath moving all the way up through the possibilities of your spine to find your responsibility point. And when you're ready, exhale softly. Okay. Let's take a little rebound on this point by, I don't know if you feel, you should feel a little bit of like something has moved in here. So let's help it move faster this time, okay? So we will shake our charms. This is the area of our charms. Again, this is our luck. This is our links, okay? This is our shoulds. We're, we're trying to get to today to exercise our shoulds. And let's go ahead and we will close 
our eyes, we will focus on our imagination point and we will take really deep breaths as we shake everything. So let's do it together, okay? So let's all go internally in, focus on our imagination point. Let's all take a big breath together from our knees and exhale from our wands and another one. Let's inhale from our knees and exhale from our wands and let's take a last inhale to prepare and now let's shake for one and a half minute. Shake in all directions. Try to feel the way that your arms want to shake and reach out and just make sure that your links and your lugs are really shaking and make sure that this area that we just massaged is also moving. So big inhales and big inhales and enjoyable long exhales. We have one more minute to go. Inhale always from your knees and exhale from your wands for this one. Create heat in the area of your own responsibility. Try to find what your responsibility is in these times of stress. Try to let go of your should and should have done for now. This is not the time for all this. This is the time for introspection. So focus on your imagination point and just shake. Uh, okay, and this a couple of last breaths. One big inhale and an exhale. Another one and an exhale. And now let's take a big inhale and hold and reach out with our charms all the way with the links extending to the sky. Hold, 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 hold. Squeeze your inspiration point. Hold, hold, hold. And enjoyably exhale. Feel your charms going around your aura field. Stay with your input internally. So take a couple of long, deep breaths at your own time and tempo. Try to feel the sensations of your body. Take a moment to integrate the energy that is moving through you, through your charms. And let's all take an inhale together. And exhale. And let's move to the second area that we are going to be working with, which is the area of our should have done, which is somewhere here. So for this one, we have to put the lemons very close to each other, okay? And we will slowly go and move, very delicately moving on the lemons. We will put the lemons there. It's good to have your charms helping you until you find the spot. It's between your should have known better, the bones, okay? And here, oh, this should hurt. If this doesn't hurt, try to move a little bit the lemons so it hurts. Again, we interlace our locks and our links for the ones that are just joining. We're trying to self-massage our area of <coughs> should have done. So here we lean on the lemons and this time we will do very small jerky movements up and down. I hope you can all see my movements. So the movement is really small and it's like this. You're just moving a little bit from inferior to superior. So, and try to find a little bit of like short breaths here. Okay. Somebody last week said sniff, sniff. That's the, that's the motto, but without the sadness. So just move a little bit. <laughs> Let your thoughts lean on your links and your luck and your charm. So 
I don't want any stress on this area of your possibilities in your spine. Okay, I just want you to be moving on the lemons. Try to find the point that hurts and just rub on it with really small, tiny upward to downward movements. Big inhale from your knees and exhale from your wands and just lean on the lemons. Don't put all your weight on them, just enough so the scent comes out. Okay, a couple of more long breaths here. Just from up and down. If you feel really comfortable, you can move a little sideways, but very, very tenderly so. Keep the movement up and down. Ah. And enjoy this little pain that you're creating. It's releasing a lot of your should have been, and it's a very important time to do so. And whenever you're ready, take a big inhale and hold it for a little bit and then enjoy the exhale from your wands and whenever you're ready let's go ahead and get up from the mat let's take a little rebound for this we will sit like like a little baby ball we will take our charms and we will hug ourselves as much as we can And we will go and place our thoughts as far. If we cannot reach down, we just kind of try to stay relaxed. And we will take really big inhales and exhales, always from our knees and exhaling from our wands. So we sent the air in this area of I should have been, which we just massaged, okay? So... Try to send the air there, feel the air opening up even more, these shoots, breaking them. Feel the air going in there and helping you to resolve, okay? Let's take three more long breaths. Another one. And hold a little bit here, the air, and then exhale from your wands and last huge inhale from your knees opening up internally and exhale from your wands okay now we will be moving to the last and more difficult area it's the area I should have known which is how the whole area of I should have known better which is the area we're massaging, all the colors is together, I should have known better. This area is gonna be more demanding. So again, take your lemons. This time, the area is somewhere here. So it's, it's an area that if you, it's like almost like the highest point that you can reach on this position, okay? And here the, the lemons are not close to each other like the one before, they're a little bit more far apart, okay? For the ones that are just joining, you can join us on this exercise. Have your lemons on this area, which is the area I should have known better. And then slowly lean on this area. Now this area is a little bit different for everybody. So feel free to move around and try to find where exactly you need to be. This is at your own discretion, as is your should have done area. Okay, here. Again, we take our luck and our links and we interlace them behind our thoughts. We make sure that our thoughts are leaning on our charms and the weight is all on our charms. And here we will slowly take a little bit of lift with our past and our elvis like this 
So in the end, we end up putting all the weight on the lemons. So here is the point that the lemons have to feel the pressure. So let's go ahead, lift, lift here and go for it. Here you can do a little bit of both of adjustments for sure, but of both movements. So you have to repeat this movement we just did, which is up and down, or we can go to the first movement, which is side to side. This really hurts. And the lemon should splash at some point. So take big inhales from your knees and exhale from your wands. Let's go. Lean on the lemons, help them resolve the tension in that area. And if you feel really confident, you can also move your charms and try to find other areas that this might hurt. But if you're just uh, here, it's also enough. As long as you have a lot of weight on that area and you're moving around it. Oh. Big inhales and exhales. <laughs> At some point, the lemons should splash like mine did. This is when the problems have been resolved. So let's go ahead and take a little <laughs> rebound here, which is going to be, we did our hug. So maybe now we have to go to something more active. And for that, we will use what we learned last week. For the ones that are just joining and were not last week, we learned with our talent point here, this area, how to create heat, talent, determination, and confidence. So it's also a point of commitment, and this is a good time to use it. So let's go ahead and sit in a very nice and easy pose, like this. Move a little bit on the side if you splash the lambs like I did. And we will go ahead and we will shrug our shoulds. Shrug sh sh shoulds are this area here. Shrug is this movement. So we will do this with a breath of talent. We will all together start. I'm just explaining. So we will focus on our imagination point. We will shrug our shoulds on the inhale from our knees and we will exhale. We actually not gonna focus too much on the inhale because this is a breath of talent. So it looks a little something like this. We're pumping our talent point so we create commitment at this difficult point in time. And we're focusing on exhaling forcefully from our knees, okay? So let's all go ahead together. Take a big inhale. Close your sensory input, focus on your inspiration point, and exhale. Take another big inhale from your knees. You can also hear exhale from your wands. Take a third inhale so we can start, and let's go. Keep on moving your shoulds up and down, inhale up, exhale down. I'm trying to also demonstrate the breath from the talent point so people get it. If you already got it, just keep on going with the movement of your shoulds. pumping through you, feel the heat that you created, smell the scent of the lemons that is around you and just give it all you got for the last 30 seconds. Ten more seconds. 
give it all you got and when I say inhale you take a huge inhale and you squeeze your inspiration point which you know where it is deep inside you and you hold the breath so three two one huge inhale the shoulders are up shoot everything must have been should have done shrugging hold 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 squeeze your inspiration draw in all your talent feel it shooting up all the way to your thoughts and beyond and exhale sloth and stay in your own space internally take breaths that feel enjoyable and follow the rhythm of your own energy stay here one big long breath from your needs and exhale from your wants and another one from your needs and exhale from your wants and let's take another big inhale from our needs and let's all meet back in this screen and we're always running out of time so I just want to finish up with a very important last opening for the area that we did because this area here the area that we exercise should have been should have done should have known there is a very deep point inside which is the liberation point but it's so deep that you know it doesn't even show in this diagram it's actually between the area of our best which we learned last week and we will be working with again next week and the area that we exercise today which is a should have known should have been should have done should have known better in total so for this last exercise it's a breathing exercise again we will interlace our links and we will put a lot of force on our luck we make sure that our charms are parallel we sit as comfortably and try to open up a little bit your past so you have a very sturdy space to sit on you interlace and you take um you take really big inhales from your needs and when you exhale you pull as much as you can your links so you want to break your own luck in pieces but you're just holding on to it okay so let's do it together inhale and on the exhale pull 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 apart drawing also your talent point and squeeze your inspiration on the exhale another long inhale and then pull 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 hold 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 exhale softly while you push and pull feel your whole charm shaking feel the area of your liberation opening up so last one inhale and exhale pull 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 try to pull this apart break it in half and with a soft exhale we will meet again in here and this is the end of our session for today i hope your lemon splashed and um, i hope the scent of aromatherapy of the skin of the lemon is all around you i also hope that you will now go and drink them once we're over with with this exercises we have to make sure we consume the lemons full of vitamin c as we know we all need them for our immune system and uh, let me say that we will meet again next week and for next week we will be using a couple of books so make sure you have a couple of a5 books i have two of my favorite writers here so we will be using a5 size books have two three of them around try to choose the ones that have a nice thickness okay and um, and we will also be needing something of a t-shirt a very small towel a sweater something comfy okay so drink your lemon juice and i will see you next week for a little bit more action and and a little more in literary interactive action and get your books drink your lemons and see you next Wednesday again here. Bye. If I knew how
Close this eyewood. 